it is me Zarela and I am back with another video on my channel and this is as you can see by the title a mod review on teen age pregnancy in the sims 4 so I called it the 16 and pregnant just because you know 16 you're pregnant you know you're a teenager whatever so <laughs> I just thought I would throw that in the title um but yeah so I'm basically going to be showing you guys how you can get your sim to how you can get your team sim to have a baby so um disclaimer or whatever i am not promoting teenage pregnancy i'm not demoting it because i know it happens and if it happens then it happens but i'm definitely not promoting anybody to go and have a baby or anything so don't think that this is something wrong that i'm doing or whatever whatever i'm just showing you guys how to get your sims pregnant if you want your teenage sims to get pregnant plus i'm only showing you guys this is a game so don't get mad at me for sh i don't know because so, some people are like why are you promoting this and this is not right no no i'm not trying to do that i'm just trying to help you guys if you want your teen to accidentally get knocked up or whatever so i'm gonna show you be showing you guys a lot so anyways um so for what you're gonna need to do is get this mc command center mod this mod is everything Deadpool, you are the best for making this mod this mod is the ish, and when I tell you it's the ish, it is the ish, okay? So, <laughs> this mod is just like, it's kind of like the Enros mod that was in The Sims 3, but this is in The Sims 4, it's called MC Command Center, and you're going to need this mod to uh, be able to get your teen sims pregnant. Now, they have so much within this mod, so comment down below if you can want me to go over some more things in this mod and we can learn and, you know, learn about this mod together because I don't even know everything about this mod, but yeah. So, first you're going to need MC Command Center, so what you're going to do is go to the link that I leave down below and you're going to go to Files. Another thing is you do have to have a... Um, what is it called a membership like you have to sign up for this I don't know why I'm not signed in and it's still working but I don't know but um what I believe is that you do have to have a membership to be able to download anything from all the sims so I don't know just just make a uh, just sign up and then um, yeah so anyways make a account and you'll be able to download this so what you're gonna do is go to files and then you are going to go all the way down to MC command center all modules so you're gonna click that and it's going to start downloading what you do have to have is some type of zip um, opener like WinWar or um, Renwar or 7-Zip, so I will leave links down below to that also for you guys to be able to download that. Um, after that, you are going to have all of these files that you're going to need to put into your game. So, how to put those into your game, you're just going to go ahead and select all of them. And then you're going to hit Extract to Documents, Electronic Arts, The Sims 4, and put it in your Mods folder and hit okay if you have a specific file that you want to put it in or specific folder is what I meant to say that you want to put it in then you're going to put it in that now I have a, a folder called MC command so I'm going to put it in that folder and for me it's going to say the following file already exists would you like to replace it um, I'm going to do yes to all because there was an update today to this mod so I needed to reinstall it anyway so I picked the right day to do this but um so yeah whenever there is updates and stuff that's just how you do it also you just replace those files with the new files and that is how you update the mod okay so the next thing you're going to need which is a big big part of this to get your sims pregnant 
your teen sims pregnant you're gonna need the mc woohoo this is a another section within you see how okay let me show you guys <laughs> you see how there is all of these things like mc dresser where you can change your sims within all whatever um population pregnancy and whatever so woohoo mc woohoo handles romantic interactions between the control sim and other sims um so yeah you'll have to get that over here you do have to be 18 or older to be able to download this you have to make an account also but you know if you're younger than 18 and you want to get it then all you gotta do is just lie about your age like it's okay nobody's gonna come and hunt you down it's okay lie about that age girl okay <laughs> um okay so yeah you're gonna need this also so you're gonna do the same things files and then you're going to click on this and it is going to open in whatever you have winwar or 7-zip and you're going to select both of them and do the same thing Put them in your mods folder and I'm gonna put it in my MC command folder and I'm gonna replace it all right so that was the steps on how to get the mod so let's go ahead and get into the mod itself okay guys so we are here with our sim Malia Brown and she's going to be our sim today to test out how on how to get her pregnant or a teen sim pregnant so um yeah I just want to give you guys a little backstory of her because I am a let's player and I just want to let you guys know about her before you get quick to judge okay so first of all she was talking to a young adult she is a teenager um, she is 16 about to be 17 she is talking to a young adult or she's in a relationship with a young adult her parents did not agree of that and she would not stop talking to him so her parents kicked her out and now she is living with him um, so she went and got all the piercings she can get. She got <laughs> um, tattoos and everything. So she dyed her hair. So she just went all out now that she is free out into the world. But this is kind of what she wants. She's with her man and she is living life. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so let me go ahead and show you guys that she is a teen. So it does say Malia Brown teen and then i'm going to show you guys that he is a young adult it says raheem more young adult so this is raheem more and this is a sim created by viva my wife we are married guys if you didn't know but yeah she created him he's beautiful they are both dreadheads so i thought that was cute but anyways yeah i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some stuff Okay, so a big part of this mod is you are going to need a computer. So, um, first of all, you're going to go to, you're going to click the computer, you're going to go to MC Command Center, and within that, we are going to go straight to MC Woohoo. So, I'm going to go over some of this stuff. So, first of all, it says Woohoo Actions. What you're going to need is to have allow teens to be true. So, you're going to click allow teens and you are going to have to restart your game for that to work and it has all these other options i don't advise allow family because that is just gross <laughs> so yeah um that is that woohoo pregnancy um i'm going to put the risky woohoo percent on 100 because i'm going to just have my sim go ahead and woohoo and see if she gets pregnant so yeah we have a risky woohoo percent we have some other options and in other settings you can set on on uh you know what that says woohoo i know how to read it but i just can't tonight but yeah so they'll woohoo on their own and stuff and it does require a restart so yeah after that is done you should get the options let's just get our sims our sims all flirty so let's go over here and 
attempt to seduce him. Stop eating, girl. Let's see if we can attempt to seduce him. See if we can get off flirty and stuff. It's not the first kiss. <laughs> Alright, so... I just want to get them off flirty and stuff. We're going to kiss his neck and stuff. And then I'm going to show you guys. Okay. So now... You guys should be able to get the option of woohoo and also try for a baby. So we are going to go ahead and have them woohoo. We're going to test out this risky woohoo. We did set it to 100%. So we're going to go over and have them woohoo. Showing you guys that she is still a teen and he is still a young adult. There you go. So they are going to go in the room to get it on. <laughs> okay. Alright. Hurry up. So long, woohoo. Alright. So after that, we are going to wake her up and have her go to the bathroom. So I'm going to send her over here to the bathroom and as you can see she can take a pregnancy test because we put the risky woohoo percent all the way to 100. So let's go over and have her take a pregnancy test. <gasps> Congratulations Malia is expecting there's going to be a new addition to the household so it definitely worked. I don't know if we see a baby bump yet, but she is definitely pregnant. So right here it says eating for two. It is thrilling to discover egg life growing inside of you. All right, so now we are going to go ahead and test out how the baby looks and everything. So to do that, we're going to go to MC Pregnancy. And right here you can change the pregnancy's face and you can make her it to where she's not showing. Right now she is in her first trimester. We can make it to where she's not showing. We can make it to where she's in her second trimester, or we can make it to where she's in her third trimester, or even in labor, which is crazy. Okay, so then there is offspring, and it says a maximum of three babies. So if we wanna have triplets or twins, we can do one male and one female. Or we can even do um, just one female. Just whatever you want, okay? Whatever you want, but let's fix that. We're going to put zero here and one. Okay, so zero pregnant with zero males and one female. And we are on trimester one. So we can do this to have the pregnancy in. Immediately clear the pregnancy and specify offspring count so you can do that but yeah so we're gonna go ahead and see how this works so, okay so now I'm going to show you guys the different pregnancy phases so this is the first trimester and how big her stomach is now we are going to do the second trimester and the third trimester so as you can see her stomach got bigger and bigger and now she is in her third trimester um, it's crazy that she did this pose it's so cute but um yeah so we are going to go ahead and um make her in labor so we are going into labor and okay so now i'm going to have her go ahead and have the baby at the household and we are going to join her with raheem um, I would do it at the house, but for some reason it will not let me buy anything for that lot. So, just gonna go to the hospital. We can experience this together. Alrighty, so we are here at the hospital, and here is Malia walking down. 
about to give labor. So I'm going to teleport Rahim in here. So he can witness this. So as you see, this teenager, let me go ahead and show you guys that she's still a teen. She is giving birth, guys. All right, so it is a girl because we had said it that to be a girl, and yeah, so we alrighty, so we are going to name our girl Jada, and let's see what happens. We have our little baby over here. This is Jada Brown, and yes, okay, she still got her little baby bump I have no idea why but maybe it'll go down or maybe this is a glitch within it so we are gonna run into some glitches but it is fine so um, let's see if she's still pregnant she is definitely not so we are going to go ahead and go home now and okay so I just wanted to create a sim if you guys run into this problem all you have to do is pull her stomach back down <laughs> Or pull their stomach back down. But you can leave like a little pudge just to make it like realistic or whatever. So, yeah. Alrighty. So now that we have our baby, we are going to go and make sure that we can do everything that we can um, with a baby. So, yeah. Let's go and do that. Where is the apartment? I'm confused. Alright. Okay, so let's see if we can talk. We can definitely do everything that we could. We are going to breastfeed. I just want to see how cute this is. Gotta get a pic. Okay, so now we are going to go ahead and age up the baby so we can see if the baby comes out looking like the both of them. So, you're going to age up. Okay, where are you, girl? Random traits. Alright, we are going to go into create a sim and I'm just gonna go with you guys so you guys won't think that I cheated or changed her looks or anything um yeah so let me just give this girl some stuff so we can look and see if she looks anything like her parents all right so let's see okay so one of them has to have brown eyes so beneath these eyes beneath these she has brown eyes all right so that is great we got that i definitely think that she looks like them she just has fatter cheeks um i don't know she came out with her mom's eyes she came out with her mom's nose I don't see too much of the dad, but I'm pretty sure, I think she has her dad's lips. I think it works, guys. It definitely works. So tell me what you guys think. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Unfortunately, I have to end this, and I hope you guys enjoy. But if you did, then leave a like and a sweet, sweet comment down below. And if you are new to my channel, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button because I love you. That's why. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.